Today we are looking at the Nerf Rapid Strike CS18. Now, there are a few things I do want to point out too before I start this video. First of all, I want to start recording back up here in my room again and not downstairs. Because usually, well first, uh, I don't know. But anyways, here is a Rapid Strike. It is very nice. But anyways, this... Blaster, I heard, is one of the best quality blasters ever made, that Nerf has ever made. And, also, for the box, I did what, I would do an unboxing, but, I'm sorry guys, but once I got it, I, at the time, it was too late, I had to go, um, get to bed since I had school at 7 o'clock in the morning. But, um, anyway, I got to be able to do it, and that morning, or that morning, I just had to open it. And my tripod, I forgot that I was at my friend's house during, um, I was at my friend's house yesterday, and I left it over there, so yeah. Now, I can pretty much not, or I'm recording with a selfie stick. I know, it's kind of sad. Anyways, so, as we get, um, back into the video, um, the Rapid Strike, um, for the box, it does say CS, which means it's a clip, a clip system, 18. Why is because it, it comes with this humongous map? And camera, this does not look that big. But if you really think about it, it's bigger than my head. Or is it? Yes, bigger than my head. That's how big it is. And I, I have a normal face head, so yeah, it's not like I have a small head or anything. Here, actually, let's compare it to the blaster. All the way to the end. It goes all the way up to the end of the stripe. So yeah. Also, once this, um, I just want to point out the rest of a few things before I start this video. This thing, um, is an extra version. Or this is an exclusive version or like an updated version of it. Since whenever it first came out, this, these stripes were orange or orange. And that little stock thing was gray. But nothing too much. But I'm not sure if they changed the internals. I'm not, I doubt they did. But anyways, I do have an extra version of Selena if you want to go, um, find, if you want to go do a, an old review and see if, if, I'll just say you wanted it, I don't know why, but if you want to see the old Rapid Strike, then I'll, I will put a link in the description for it. But anyways, and here's the last thing I want to point out, I know I keep pointing out basically everything, but the Rapid Strike when it says CS18, well, it's a clip system for CS. And the 18 for 18 mag, but I noticed that for the modulus and like the strife and stuff like that has ECS, which means for an electronic. Now I'm not sure why this doesn't have the ECS 18. I'm not sure if they already made it or not. I don't. I don't. Yeah, I don't think it. Yeah, I, don't, I haven't made a um, ECS 18 yet. But anyways, um, here it is. Now I'm gonna get a little bit. Or with the camera, I'm going to make the camera zoom in a little bit, and I am going to, let's look at a little bit closer to this awesome, unique $40 blaster. So the Rapid Strike, it does say Nerf right there, and if you look closely, it says Rapid Strike um, CS18. But yeah, I know, for some reason, like my camera, I do have, I'm recording on a iPod, but for some reason, it's like backwards, so really this way is that way is but for some reason like the words and stuff that is backwards so yeah i'm sorry but it's basically the best i can do here there yeah it's even on that side anyways so here it is it is a very nice it's in from the instruct elite which is very nice it says elite right there it's got the white stripes and nerf it's got five tactical rails one right here to carry one on top two on side one on here one on the other side, one on the bottom, which counts as five, and then, right, and then the stock can is extendable, very very comfy stock, and yeah, um, this is this does have an acceleration trigger right there, which you can see the orange one I'm clicking right now, and 
Um, think if this does have a extension barrel right there, which means you can put any barrel you want to. But you can hear the batteries kind of shake. This thing, I will. Well, I won't um, take it out for you guys, or um, I might, but um, what you need to do is you need to those three right there, um, one right there, one right there, and one on the bottom. Those, um, oh yeah, you can actually see the put it selfie stick. <laughs> um, but anyways, what I was saying, um, oh yeah, what I was saying is that you just need to unscrew those with the actual screwdriver. You can't take like one of the small ones that usually take to take apart Nerf guns. But once you do, you need to take four, four, yes, four C batteries. C, everybody, C. And yeah, it's kind of crazy. C batteries, and you need to just insert them in and just unscrew it, and then you're ready to go. Now this is the second full auto blaster ever made, I think. And if you don't know what full auto it is, it's where you hold down a trigger, it goes doing, 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 and it shoots it into the flywheel and it goes flying out. This thing is awesome. Now, this is my first full auto blaster, too. But yeah, now, like I was saying, or now let's get more into it a little bit. This thing does, how you extend the stock is right now, as you see, you have to pull the trigger to extend it. But for right now, I guess. You, with without pulling the trigger, if you just want to extend it like in fat real fast, you can just take it and you can pull it out. Now you can't do it back in, but you can. But uh, you go back to aiming. Now there, now right here, it does have a flip up sight right there, and as you can see, this thing has very good aiming. Can be. You can kind of see it, but this thing has very good aiming. It's because you look through, because you look through that hole right there, the orange one. Well, you can kind of see it, and it looks through there, goes through there, and it looks through that thing. Now, why it's a flip up sight? Because let's just say that you put the retaliator extension barrel, the flip up sight. Um, this would be blocking. This would be in the way here. So yeah, and then um, right here. Uh, oh, sorry. oh, yeah, sorry. Someone just talking to me for a second. I usually, that's why I was looking over there. I get distracted sometimes. Like, anyways, like I was saying, if you put a retaliator thing, this would be blocking it. And, yeah, it would be a flip-up sight. And then you can actually use that flip-up sight from the extension barrel. So, yeah, this thing is very comfy right here. It, and this is pretty big, too. And, yeah, now I guess, oh, yeah, it does have a jam door right there. And you get to see your darts, which I right, now let's get into the magazine. It does come with 18 darts. I got them all right here. That's not all of it. I have a lot more. This is a huge magazine. Like I said, it's bigger than my face. And yeah, there's an 18 round. And if you kind of look in the sunlight, you can kind of see that it does it here. You can see it kind of says 8 here. You can kind of see it, but it says 18. And it does have these rubber things. Why? It's because if you were in a war and you just dropped it out, it wouldn't, like, the rubber would hit your floor and not the plastic. So it wouldn't dent in your wood or make a mark on the magazine. And it has, since it's clear, it has very smooth plastic. Now, I will want to know, if you do have a recon mark too, this won't fit in it. Because of this little annoying thing, I'm not really sure why they really included that. But, yeah, it also does say where the dark um, face so yeah, and then you just do this. Now, the once you put in the batteries, you just pull the acceleration trigger, and this is what happens. It revs up, and once you hold down the trigger, it gets the the uh, revving gets a lot louder. And once you or whenever you pull the trigger, it starts getting a lot louder. Ready? It's pretty crazy, and you can even see kind of. You can see how fast it goes. Look, you can see this little thing moving. Yeah, this is a really insane blaster. I actually, um, do this up. This thing is not rare at all, so if you're worried that this is going to be rare since it's very nice quality and everything. Well, it's actually not rare. I've never seen this. I've never not seen this at a store. So, yeah. I think I covered everything. It does say, I know I said Elite, but I'm, it says it on both sides. You can see, or no, never mind, I am wrong. 
<laughs> Anyways, it does say Instar KV on both sides. This time I know it says it on both sides. Right to there. And it does have um, a sling point. This doesn't really count as a sling point right here. And it's got one, it's got basically two right here, but I would not put any attaching the thing right there because it would block your aiming. Now, this thing is also a cheek rest. Now, if you're a kid, like if you're old as me, you would have, you could go like this, it's kind of hard to aim. But if you're like a grown up, it'd be a lot easier to aim. If you were, this is a cheek rest. Now, if you pull this back, you would. Your your cheek your cheek would kind of get on it, not much. And um, I think I pretty much covered everything. I know there was one I think I forgot. I feel like I'm missing something. Oh yeah, the other same points. There is one right here. And yeah, cause so it comes so you can. Oh yeah, there's also one right here, so you can attach these two. You can attach any combination right there. So yeah, now this thing is awesome. 18 to my, to my highest capacity mag, and it is the highest capacity magazine. I know you've heard like drums and or not drums. You've heard like 25 darts, 35 darts. There are in other Nerf guns. Well, um, this is that's a drum. This is the highest capacity magazine. I've never seen a pat or a actual magazine that's like 20 darts or 19 or any of that like any higher than it's because it'd be called a drum if it was 25 or 35 those are called drums but yeah i think that's basically it now we can um go and uh yeah shoot the thing i guess i'll just um real quick load this in so this does come with 18 let right, see i'm gonna go load this up real quick and i will be right back. I know you can see my hand, and just because I'm getting ready to stop the recording, or not really recording, I'm taking a little cut. So I'm gonna load this up, and yeah, we're gonna go for this. I cannot do it out outside because it's pretty late. It's um, well, it's about nine o'clock, which that's which is me to dark out. So yeah, or it's nine o'clock p.m. So yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, so here is it fully loaded. I really like how it looks fully loaded. I don't know why. But with the magazine fully loaded, it just feels good to carry it. I have no idea. It's probably just me. But, yeah, anyways, um, this thing, just not in that, but, anyways, here we go. It's, it has 18 max. You can try to fit another dart, but I wouldn't recommend it. I know my first, or one of my first videos I ever made did have it, or I did say that you can fit in another dart, which is kind of weird. But since that, that, this is one of my first Nerf games I ever got, so, I didn't really know that stuff at the time, but I would recommend it because it will jam your Nerf gun. Even though this thing, I have never seen this thing jam. So, yeah, we're going to go shoot in the hallway or the length of um, my house. Um, so, yeah, I'll be a reaction of. We're going to shoot in here since I'll have a tripod. Can't really do it. So, yeah, this thing, I will be shooting up right at that green square and yeah basically be right where I was see this is my nerf gun I'm gonna be shooting at it where we're already know since this thing is in strike you beat this thing's accurate actually to note actually I'm sorry I'm wrong this thing is not that accurate or it is it's accurate but not the most accurate press up Here's full automatic, not semi automatic. See? No jams. No jams. 18 darts. So, yeah, there is the nerf. Rapid Strike, I think this is going to be. This is the most popular nerf blaster that I've seen ever. Now, this thing. If I do get another one of these, I'm definitely going to not mod this, but I'm going to hit this. I can hear the batteries. So, yeah. Um. Anyways, hope you guys have enjoyed the video. So, yeah, I know Um. Not my thumbnails. I've changed all my videos, or almost all my videos, into new thumbnails. Yeah, this one's going to be really uh, pretty cool pictures since I've 
saw some pretty good pictures. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. So yeah, I guess I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.